Hello. So I had a dream a week ago and I'll be real honest, I was really hesitant to share it because of my own human thoughts and I was thinking about this topic the day beforehand, wondering if it was my subconscious. Um, even though I still feel kind of not secure, the Lord is telling me speak boldly. So I'm going to just really try and do that. Um, so, and try not make excuses. <laughs> um, I want to say if this is my subconscious, I'm I'm sorry. I'm human, and and even though I may see a big part of the picture, I might get some things wrong. But that's my human side speaking. That. Um, Otherwise, if it is a strong dream from God, then I clearly need to do what he's asked me to do. So I'm just going to share the dream. Okay, with that said, I'm going to share the dream. So I wrote it down. Um, and I'm just going to read what I wrote. Okay. I had a dream about a week ago. I dreamt that I was talking to my dad and said, Trump would win. Trump is the winner. The people will say it was because he cheated or cheating. Then it will cause massive riots. I told Dad that all of this that is happening is a setup. It's false and it is a show. They wanted to cause riots. They wanted the people to riot so they could set the stage for a false assassination. The whole world would see that Trump appeared to be assassinated and then appear to heal. But he never really healed because behind the scenes it was fake. Then all the world would marvel after him and say, who can make war with the beast? And I woke up. So that's what I dreamt. Um, I would also like to just read the other thing I wrote down. So, the Lord has told me that Trump is the seventh king and has shown me that he is the one to receive a wound to the head. He showed me that he was the seventh king by showing Trump's face, a face of a lion, and I heard seventh king in a dream. The beast in Revelation has seven heads, which represent seven mountains that seven kings rule over. One of the heads receives a deadly wound and is healed, and goes on to rule the nations for 42 months with a mouth of a lion, which speaks great blasphemies. So I understand this to, to mean that the Lord is saying, Trump is the mouthpiece. Then the second beast requires the whole world to worship the first beast, whose deadly wound was healed. Or it says in the Bible, his wound by, he had a wound by a sword and did live. And to worship his image and receive the mark, vaccine. We also must remember there are ten kings that rule alongside these two beasts. The Antichrist will set up his tabernacle between the seas, America and Jerusalem. That's all I have to say. So that's what I wrote. Okay, see ya.